Hello everyone. Today we are going to be looking into really quick how the Harkles feel about Lady C, who's appeared on a Dan Wooten podcast today, Dan Wooten outspoken on his YouTube channel, and said that she's challenged the Harkles to produce documentation that Archie and Lily Bucks were born of body. And if they can't do that, they should remove from the line of succession. That's kind of it in a nutshell. There's a lot more nuances in it. There's a lot more. You've probably already seen it, so you don't need. So I'm going to have a look and see how Harry and Megsy are reacting to this because they will pay attention to Dan. I mean, Harry name checked him in spare and they will pay attention to Lady C. So let us have a look. Let us see. I've got the Midnight Magic Tarot, which is mushrooms, because, you know, Harry loves mushrooms. So I'm using that deck for Harry. And I have got the Mad Men Mystics and I forget it, the other one, um, Tarot uh, for Megsy. So we're going to start off with Megsy. Uh, and then we're going to look at Harry. And then I'm going to pull a few cards from the Deadly Apocryphy Oracle deck just to see where they are at with all of this. So let's see what we've got. Let's see what the cards have. How does Megan feel about this? Or how will Megan feel about this? Let's have a look, see. Let's see. So if you're new here, I do Celtic Cross Spreads. I work in layers. The first spread is going to be for Megzy. Uh, let us have a look. I'm trying to be quite quick as well because I don't have a lot of battery on my laptop. So uh, let's go. Megan, strength card. Oh, it is all about her straight away. So straight away, the strength card comes in. Megzy is a Leo. So she is straight all about me. This is all about me. This is just about me. She's going to make it when she replies or if she replies, <clears throat> she is going to come out of the bat saying it's because of who she is and link it to intrinsic characteristics that she was born with. Let's have a look what's crossing over her because the strength card relates to the astrological sign of Leo and Megsy is a Leo. So she's automatically, it's about me straight away. What's crossing over her is the seven of wands. Ha. They want to go on the attack. She's trying not to. I feel like this is part of her, part of their new PR strategy is not to like try and rebuff things so quickly, but that's pressing on her. She wants to go and tell people to, she wants to correct them to her version of events. I'm not saying her version of events is correct. I don't believe that. But she wants to come out and she wants to basically attack Lady C and Dan somehow. They, they want to go after them. So there may be an enhanced issues with the Sussex squad. There may be um, further mewling from people like the guy with the weird forehead and, you know, the photographer guy. And, of course, it could well be that <clears throat> the the tech expert dude. Oh, yeah, and Ahmed Scabies, that dude. So there's two things going on there straight away. I'm not surprised to see the Seven of Wands in reverse because that's what they do. They go on the attack but they say they're on the defensive but they're defending themselves but they're not what's above the situation six of cups okay that's an interesting one to be above and what's underneath the ace of swords Ooh, 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 ooh. they are frustrated as hell with this they are really not happy really not happy really not happy i feel like they're going to try and bring the kids in and the kids safety um if any rebuttal comes they're going to spin it like how dare you talk about a children like that kind of thing and then they're going to try and 
kind of triangulate it with the six of cups the six of cups is all about you know rose tinted glasses childhood looking at the past they're going to try and triangulate it with regards to what happened to harry during harry's childhood and how harry needed to be protected so they're going to they're going to try and make something like that with it but they're not happy they're not happy they may try some litigation but it looks like at the moment they're being told not to we shall see we shall see she wants to but she, they they are quite frustrated because they are being told not to what's leaving the situation is the four of swords in reverse i feel like <clears throat> if you go back to the south southwest speech i feel like she knew that was coming and she and she has tried to put the nail in this particular story into this coffin quite quickly that four of swords as well is all of all of the stuff about being hereditary um in inheritance if you will from the royals they want the titles we know this they want the titles that but they want a lifestyle like gwyneth paltrow has or kim kardashian or beyonce that she is going to make it all about um i would say she would say like it's something about the queen's passing and people are being allowed to say things like this uh because the four of swords is in reverse it's my death card so i wonder if she's going to like link it back to the queen's passing and how these journalists have got more spicy since then she's they're going to try to say something like that man they really are there's something going on here knight of cups is what's coming up um this is in the near future so obviously knight of cups um we've got this this is to me as a reader the knight of cups we're looking at like megzy like i've been saying for years she's going to try and come back and be like this kind of influencer pe person even back in 2019 i said she's going to come back she's going to end up doing qvc and here we are she's she's not necessarily qvc but she's she's hawking jam so there's that so we'll probably get her trying to push past this the seven of cups is in reverse so expect some serious gaslighting with this guys expect some serious gaslighting and what's surrounding her is the star okay an Aquarius, an Aquarius. So is Oprah gonna say something? Is Ellen gonna say something? Is one of her Aquarian friends gonna say something? I think Dan's a Pisces, I think. I'm pretty sure Lady C's a Leo, I think. I don't know, I don't know, but that's just off the top of my head, I'm pretty sure. Let's have a look at this. Ten of Wands, she's carrying a burden. She wants relief of this burden. I think we know what that burden is. And the Eight of Pentacles, she's going to try and do some work. Wow. That little figure kind of looks like her a bit, doesn't it? Okay, moving on. Um, I don't think they are going to come out and do it themselves like rebuff it themselves so far but let's have a look at harry let's have a look at harry see how he feels about it Whew. and then i'll pull some oracle cards Four of Cups in reverse. Okay. He's receptive to something. He's actually receptive to something, but what? The Ace of Pentacles in reverse crossing over. They have been told not to like try and correct the record and stay away from the media, you know? Because it's it's money, it's costing. We've got the Ace of Swords in reverse and the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. 
right now what's going on for them they're being told to stay away and try not to kind of like get involved in spats with people mm. the three of cups is in reverse okay so he's putting this down to bad blood gossip harshness that kind of thing he's putting it down to people causing trouble and people being just nasty about him and gossiping and stuff like that that's what they're going to try and put it down to and then they're going to try and triangulate it somehow back to um harry's experience as a child not unless we're not going to get the about megan's experience as a child because that would be boring because we've already heard that letter writing story about 15 times 16 times 160 times i mean it's just it, it's never ending is it okay let's see what's underneath harry wheel of fortune bad timing out of luck so he feels like he's this is just people picking at him uh he doesn't want things to be discovered he doesn't want um any change he just thinks this is bad timing so it's interesting that he is more on the bad timing side of things so i would... hmm. and temperance in reverse could bring things together eh? now i am 99.9 .9 as sure as you can be that the moon bumps were there the moon bumps were physically there um i don't think megsy in my mind allegedly for entertainment purposes only carried either child recollections may vary shall we say about how the kid even got here we have the two of swords which is weighing things up interesting 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 this might well be him there's the page of cups in reverse again now i read the cards astrologically the page of cups we're looking at a younger cancerian a younger water sign younger scorpio younger pisces um Again, this could well be Harry saying, oh, they don't treat, they don't treat George and Charlotte and Louis like they treat our kids. The thing is, if you're going to be really secretive and push people away, I remember when Archie was born, it was so weird, like everything was out of sync and then he turned up in the stables saying, oh yeah, uh, the wife's dropped a sprog, I got high on gas. Well, he didn't say high on gas, he said that in his um, spare. But that page of cups in reverse, he's going to try and make this about William's children and how his children are treated differently to William's children straight away that's what he's going into so that matches with kind of what's the conversations that are going around what looks like how Megsy and then we'll respond to it the knight of pentacles surrounding him he is being told he needs to look after his image and he can't roll up his sleeves and get back down as he sees it. I don't believe Lady C or Dan are in the gutter, but he would see it as being in the gutter. So what's surrounding him is him really thinking, I really need to get my good public image back. The page of pentacles is what is on his mind. Archie is meant to be a Taurus, so he would resonate to the page of pentacles. Even though I don't think Archie's a Taurus, I think he's an Aries. But there we go. That's just my conspiracy. And then we have here the Knight of Wands. Okay. Eight of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands. They are really going for a younger demographic they are really going for they want to 
with Megsy. She could be the Queen of Wands. She could come out of the Knight of Wands. Um, Harry here has come out as the Knight of Pentacles. So to me, that indicates to me they are trying to do this whole influencer thing. And it's very important to Megsy that they keep having good press and they don't get down and dirty with what they seem as the tabloid press. However, we have got the two, we have got the two of swords here. This can also indicate a Libra. Now, a Libra that is involved with Harry and Megsy is Kim Kardashian. So Kim Kardashian might come out and say something. There's a few people that could come out and say something on on my tarot table right here and I feel like they are not gonna necessarily address this directly they're gonna get their lackeys to do it for them I would be very surprised with these cards if they direct addressed it directly they are not happy about it that's for sure they are aware of it um that temperance in reverse I mean sometimes Harry's cards just give away a, a lot temperance in reverse is things that couldn't get molded together and flow properly and so it shows to me that with the magnancies there was definitely some difficulties with you know conceiving um it was quite artificial with the temperance card in reverse let's see i'm going to pull a card for megan and i'm going to pull a card for harry from this deck because we do like this deck. It is the Deadly Apocalypse 3 Oracle. Um, let's have a look. Megan. Harry. I don't think they're very happy with Lady C and Dan Wanton today. But uh, do you know what? Who cares <laughs> what they think really? But it's, it's nice to have a look at, isn't it? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so Megzi has got cannabis <laughs> and Harry has got Angel's Trumpet so I feel like they're going to be feeling very sorry for themselves they may well be leaning into some substances if you will she may well uh, be yeah. Harry, on the other hand, open your mind. I feel like he is going through some things. And I don't think he gets, to be honest, neither of them do get how scandalous this whole thing is. And I really believe this is part of them running away. Not only, I think it was always on Megsy's plan, but I don't think they want wanted to run away so quickly if you will I think they want to run away quickly because you've got the bullying report you've got some issues around the kids and all of this stuff so um Harry needs to open his mind he's got a very closed off Megzi needs some healing desperately um both of them are kind of disjointed and not really in a reality where they're receptive to hear people speaking like this and speaking their truth and having genuine concerns about these children being in the line of succession. Megsy is going to try and make it or get one of her lackeys to try and make it, I should say, but all about her ethnicity, her skin tone, whatever. That's what they're going to try and blame it on. That's what they're going to try and park it as. They've got some useful idiots around them. Let just watch, and those useful idiots will appear and try and make people's lives worse because they don't like, they're intolerant of other people's viewpoints and they can't answer it. They won't answer it because there is issues there that's why they're not up front that's very much why we never see the kids to be honest it's because harry's obsessed by privacy his that his privacy even though he's done all of the opposite things he's done a therapy session with garba mate and uh his book spare and all the interviews which 
blasted not only his privacy but also uh his 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 family's privacy and with regards to Megzi, if those kids were if she was allowed to they would be merching everything left right and center but i feel that's where they are conflicted as a couple but this is just my opinion this is what i see in the cards around this i know i'm talking very quickly but i want to get this so out for you guys let me know what you think in the comments i hope you've enjoyed this reading and i'll see you really soon for some more take care of yourselves guys bye